This module is used to produce cash flow forecast report. To enable it, go to Tools, Program Control, Module Setting. Check the checkbox of Advanced Financial Report. This module is available in all editions. OK. Go to GL, Cash Flow Forecast Report. Let's say we are going to forecast weekly cash flow for 5 weeks. First of all, define the filter options. Date is the starting date of the forecast. Number column, select number or column from 1 to 10. Frequency, define the frequency of columns, either daily, weekly, bi-weekly, monthly, quarterly, or yearly. Then click on Inquiry. The result is displayed in six main sections against number of columns and frequency according to the real setting. In our case, each column represents a week starting with this date. Cash section shows the total of beginning cash, total sum of cash and bank accounts for the respective weeks. You may click on the plus sign to see the details. The adjustment amount is the result of the adjustment you make in the maintain options. Accounts receivable shows the total of outstanding from all debtors that will do in the respective week. You may click on the plus sign to see the details of each debtor. Expenses is total expenses that will be made in the respective weeks. Expenses to be made is actually maintained at maintain expenses under maintain options and the adjustment is maintained under maintain adjustment. Cash available for disbursement is the total of cash plus account receivable and minus expenses in the respective weeks. Accounts payable shows the total of outstanding from all creditors that will do in the respective weeks. You may click on the plus sign to see the details of each creditor. Ending cash balance is the total of cash available for disbursement minus accounts payable in the respective weeks. Ending cash balance of this week will be the opening cash balance for the subsequent week. Look at maintain options. Please take note that changes made here are purely for cash flow forecast reporting purpose. These changes do not affect the related accounts and the real transaction records. Maintain adjustment. Click on add to maintain adjustment amount for different sections, if there is any, and to specify the description, start date, frequency, and amount. The amount could be negative, which means to reduce, and this amount is to forecast cash movement. To see the effect, go back to cash flow forecast, click on inquiry to refresh, maintain expenses. Click on Add to maintain forecast expenses payment for different expenses account. Similarly, you can define the start date, frequency, and the amount. To see the effect, click on Inquiry to refresh and look into Expense section. Expenses maintained will be displayed in the related weeks. Maintain AR and AP forecast due date. Define the date range of documents. Click on Inquiry. A list of the documents, such as invoices, will be listed, showing the credit terms and the original due date. You may assign the forecast due date should it differs from original due date. Then click on Save. When you click on Inquiry to refresh, the respective accounts receivable or accounts payable amount will be updated. You may click on Preview to view the detailed cash flow forecast report. And of course, the report can be sent to different document format. That's all for Advanced Financial Report module. Thank you.